All right, here I am, Centerfield Night Soccer Club in Ipswich. I'm here, and so are Global Turf. So behind me we've got the grader going around. Um, it's not going off a laser, it's going off a, I've got to ask, I think it's like a DPI system or something where they can specify the fall, can fall in different directions. It's so, so accurate and apparently gives a really great finish and just having a look at it now, it's, it's pretty amazing. So they're just sort of leveling things off as best they can with like a spreader bar as you usually would. Then they're going over with this and it's impressive. It's really good to see this in person and see how sports fields are constructed because we sort of don't really appreciate that. But yeah, it's pretty interesting. So the guys from Global Turf are going to continue this process, finish the prep. Then we've got Dan from Old School Turf and Landscaping who's going to finish up the irrigation side of things as well. The next time you see me, it'll probably either be on the turf farm at Allen View harvesting the wintergreen or back here with Dan checking out the irrigation and here for installation. Okay, so we're back here at the Ipswich Knights Soccer Club. Today is the day that we're getting some turf. So we're splitting the turf install over three days for a number of reasons. You can see how big the area is. It's about 8,000 square meters. Um, we also don't want the turf to be cooking. It's very hot and humid here in Southeast Queensland, especially here in Ipswich. So they're just wetting the surface down now. Obviously Global have been in um, we had a little bit of a delay in actually getting the turf delivered uh, because they wanted to make sure the surface was perfect. So they went over it again with the grader um, over the Christmas break. And now we're back here today and we're just waiting on, I believe, Allen View Turf is sending out two semi-trailers, um, which should be here pretty shortly, actually. We've got a bunch of installers. There's a lot of action around here. Not that you can see it's actually this way. Uh, we've got turf rollers, we've got wheelbarrows, we've got a heap of labourers, so it should be a bit of a fun day. So it's all happening here. Uh, one thing I will say is while they're being super pedantic, which is great, and the turf quality is amazing from Allen View, the cut thickness is consistent the whole way along. No weeds, um, just really, really good quality, which is what you'd expect for a sports turf surface. But the efficiency of the installers is actually really, really impressive. And obviously they're professionals, they do this for a living. Um, but yeah, they've got it down to an art. Um, everyone sort of knows their role. And then it's being rolled by a, by a petrol roller in the end. So I'm gonna get out of the way because we're about to fire up these sprinklers to water the bit that's already been installed. So I reckon we've been here, I don't know, 40 minutes and it's gonna get watered in. And it's, so it's been, it's been laid, rolled, fertilized, watered. How good. Okie dokie, so day three of the turf install here. So each of the three days has been just shy of 3,000 square meters delivered and installed each day. So this has probably been the, well it is, this has been the first time that I've sort of been involved 
with a sports field construction. I've sort of seen them from afar, but it's been really cool to actually see it on a large scale, like with the laser graders and everything like that. That's been next level, and it's been really great to see how pedantic they are on some surfaces, um, on, on the surface, because, yeah, the it's amazing. The quality of the turf is great. There's been like maybe four slabs or so with weeds in it that are just quickly hand pull out of 8,000 square meters. That's, that's pretty good going. So the turf quality has been top notch. The surface preparation, again, amazing. And now we're just rolling it in to get that nice finish. And soon enough, they'll have a mower on it and away they go. So well, as they're putting the last couple of slabs down, last couple of pallets, I'm gonna leave it there, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Been on a little bit of a hiatus, sort of like Blink-182, but I'm back now. It's been great to get out again and film the content. I really hope that you got something out of it because I've had a ball, like an absolute ball, watching this being constructed and sort of come together. Um, massive thank you to Global Turf Queensland Dan from Old School Turf and Landscape, the main contractor here. Massive thank you to Allen View as well, Allen View Turf. Uh, it's, been, it's been amazing for them to let me come and actually film this for you. And now the city of Ipswich have a top tier football field to play on. So how good. Mm -hmm.